Okay guys, we are back and today we are going to be looking at another thing that I just bought from Spirit Halloween. As you guys know, Spirit Halloween has already been putting out some awesome new props for the 2023 Halloween season. I am so excited. I know you guys are excited and I cannot wait to show you this thing. The other day I showed you the first thing that I bought this season and that was this guy right here, the talking butcher. He says exactly what the uh, animatronic says. Where are you going? <laughs> he is hilarious. I absolutely love him. But guys, we have yet another one. This is the box that I teased you guys with in the short. And the other thing inside this box that I want to show you today, if I can get it out of the box, <laughs> is this guy right here. Monkey Chimes. What the heck? Look at that guy. He is so awesome looking. Look at, look at those teeth right there. What the heck, man? That guy is so scary. And as I always say, I would hate to wake up in the middle of the night and see this guy standing at the foot of my bed, clanging his cymbals. <laughs> he sort of reminds me of Monty, and it's kind of strange to me that they didn't just go ahead and make an actual Monty doll instead of this monkey chimes. Maybe that was their idea in the first place to make a Monty. And then for some reason they thought this would be better. Maybe it was a licensing issue. I have no idea. But I gotta say, this guy looks totally awesome and totally creepy. Plus he needs the Aquafresh. All right, so let's go ahead. Oh my gosh. <laughs> He just looks like a typical, like, teddy bear. Like, this this soft plush right here just feels like a typical teddy bear that you would go out and buy in a store for a little kid. But he's not a teddy bear. He is a killer monkey. Oh, my gosh. And he only has one eye. Look at that. He has... The other guy eye is, like, either gone or sunk way inside his head. So maybe... Whoa, look. That looks like there's a light on his eye socket. Look at that. I wonder if he's going to read the map wrong with his one eye! Okay, let's go ahead and get this open here. What did I do with my knife? I'm always losing everything. Let's use the scissors here. With these is that instead of twist ties, they're sending them on cards with these zip ties. With the twist ties, you can easily put them back on the card, tie it up, and you can kind of keep it like that. But with these zip ties, you either have to get your own zip ties or your own twist ties. All right, anyway, let's go ahead and take a look at this guy right here. Look at that. It's so funny. It feels like you're holding just a regular old teddy bear, like, I love you, teddy. <laughs> but then you get a good look, and you're like, ah! I swear that's what he looks like. Like, he just can't wait to bite your nose. So, we have this yellow thing here we're going to pull out. That will allow us to get some sound going on here. Now, with the butcher, I went ahead and opened him up so we could see the sound box but I did notice that on him, where the heck is it? Oh, here we go. There's a try me button, and when you push it, you actually push it, and there's like a snap thing in here that you can hear. Hold on. There you go. <laughs> that is the first time I have ever heard him. I didn't even watch any videos online. That's the first thing I've heard from him. That is awesome. It also reminds me of Indiana Jones, the Raiders of the Lost Ark, where they're running around and the monkey like brings him a bad date or something. Oh my gosh, I love this guy so much. Let's hear that one more time. <laughs> that is so creepy. It has the sound of the clanging cymbals. Wow. Those symbols actually are metal, too. They're not even plastic. So, kids, if you buy this, don't throw it at your brother or sister, because those are metal, and those can cut an eyeball out, as shown here. Oh, I didn't notice if his eye lit up. Let's do it again. Yes, look at that. His one eye lights up. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I love everything about this. This guy is so cool. I am so glad I bought him. It's funny how he's missing some fur in different areas around here. His leg, his arm. Did he miss? Um, he's not missing fur on his head, but he is missing skin off his face. This guy is $36.99 right now on the Spirit website. I can't wait to see him in stores. 
but I knew he was one that was probably going to sell out pretty dang quick, so I went ahead and ordered him because I wanted to hear him and I wanted to show you guys as well. So let's just take one more look at this guy all around. That's what he looks like in the front. We'll turn him around here. He's wearing his little vest and his bellboy hat. That is too funny, man. I love this guy. Let's hear him one more time. <laughs> oh my gosh, I love it so much. All right, now real quick, let's go ahead and open him up in the back here. With, uh, with the butcher, it's like down the middle here. You open it up just like I did with this vest. But on him, you got to open his butt. The sound box is in his butt. So there's the sound box, um, and it's it's in there. I mean, it's like glued inside. So I was looking to see if there was any kind of a, uh, like a volume knob or anything. There is not one on the Butcher. I'm not aware that there is one on any of the other talking dolls, but I just wanted to see. You never know when they're going to add a new feature. So here he is. Monkey Chimes reminds me of the movie Monkey Shines, and especially reminds me of Monty the Monkey.